In mathematics, iterated function systems are a method of constructing fractals. The resulting constructions are always self-similar. If fractals, as they are normally called, can be of any number of dimensions, but are commonly computed and drawn in 2D, the fractal is made up of the union of several copies of itself, each copy being transformed by a function. The canonical example is the Sierpinski gasket, also called the Sierpinski triangle. The functions are normally contractive, which means they bring points closer together and make shapes smaller. Hence, the shape of an ifs fractal is made up of several possibly overlapping smaller copies of itself, each of which is also made up of copies of itself, ad infinitum. This is the source of itself similar fractal nature. Definition Formally, an iterated function system is a finite set of contraction mappings on a complete metric space. Symbolically, is an iterated function system if each is a contraction on the complete metric space. Properties Hutchinson showed that, for the metric space, such a system of functions has a unique non-empty compact fixed set S. One way of constructing a fixed set is to start with an initial point or set S0 and iterate the actions of the phi, taking Sn plus 1 to be the union of the images of Sn under the phi, then taking S to be the closure of the union of the Sn. Symbolically, the unique fixed set has the property the set S is thus the fixed set of the Hutchinson operator the existence and uniqueness of S is a consequence of the contraction mapping principle, as is the fact that for any non-empty compact set in, random elements arbitrarily close to S may be obtained by the chaos game of described below. Recently it was shown that the IFSs of non-contractive type can yield attractors. These arise naturally in projective spaces, though classical irrational rotation on the circle can be adapted to the collection of functions generates a monoid under composition. If there are only two such functions, the monoid can be visualized as a binary tree, where, at each node of the tree, one may compose with the one or the other function. In general, if there are k functions, then one may visualize the monoid as a full k-a-r-y tree, also known as a Cayley tree. Constructions Sometimes each function is required to be a linear, or more generally an affine, transformation, and hence represented by a matrix. However, IFSs may also be built from nonlinear functions, including projective transformations and Mobius transformations. The fractal flame is an example of an ifs with nonlinear functions. The most common algorithm to compute ifs fractals is called the chaos game. It consists of picking a random point in the plane, then iteratively applying one of the functions chosen at random from the function system to transform the point to get an x point. An alternative algorithm is to generate each possible sequence of functions up to a given maximum length and then to plot the results of applying each of these sequences of functions to an initial point or shape. Each of these algorithms provides a global construction which generates points distributed across the whole fractal. If a small area of the fractal is being drawn, many of these points will fall outside of the screen boundaries. This makes zooming into an ifs construction drawn in this manner impractical. Although the theory of ifs requires each function to be contractive, in practice software that implements ifs only require that the whole system be contractive on average. Examples The diagram shows the construction on an ifs from two affine functions. The functions are represented by their effect on the by unit square. The combination of the two functions forms the Hutchinson operator. Three iterations of the operator are shown, and then the final images of the fixed point, the final fractal. Early examples of fractals which may be generated by an ifs include the Cantor set, first described in 1884, and the RHAM curves a type of self-similar curve described by Georges Girard H.A.M. in 1957. History IFSs were conceived in their present form by John E. Hutchinson in 1981 and popularized by Michael Barnsley's book Fractals Everywhere. IFSs provide models for certain plants, leaves, and ferns. 
by virtue of the self-similarity which often occurs in branching structures in nature. Michael Barnsley A.L.